I think that's bright enough. How are you? Good morning. It's 8 p.m. I woke up at like almost 4. I mean, it was like 2.30 and then I went back to sleep because I was still tired and then it was like 4. So, <laughs> I have a headache. I've been coughing for I think two weeks straight. I don't know why. But <laughs> basically all November actually. So since November second, third, I don't know what day it was. <sighs> if I have anything from yesterday. It's unbeknownst to me. I think it looks fine. Um, so I'm on my laptop recording, so the quality might not be as good, but it's definitely a lot easier for me. Um, I left my computer alone for a good week, and it's charging again quasi normally. I can't say it's perfect, but I think that it doesn't mean it doesn't need to be seen right away. And that's why, because like, what's the word? insurance but you know like money back guarantee when you covered whatever bring it into the shop and say hey it's only been of like two months since I saw you and it's having trouble so since it was having any trouble at all I was like let's just bring it in while it's happening now um, but then now that's like not doing anything so it's like when you're you bring your car to the shop and they're like oh there's nothing wrong with it there is. you know there is and it only happens when nobody else is around or when it's at the shop, it's perfectly fine. So, anyways. <sighs> I'm not going to use any fragrances today because of my headache. I'm very sensitive to fragrances. I am wearing the same shirt as yesterday. I slept in it and now it's just still on. But I have had a shower since then. Yeah, I don't really do much, so most of my clothes, like, they don't get sweaty or grungy. But, um, I do have, like, a three to four limit of even just, like, being bored with the same thing. Um, yeah, so we'll do some concealer first. <laughs> Whoa, well, maybe it's really not much. I think I should because it's especially hard when I'm on my computer to um, to look in at myself. It's not very, like my phone I think is a mirrored image. So it's very different for that reason. I'm using maybe this one. This has a mirror and it's tiny, but I kind of like small mirrors because I, I can like bring them right up close to my face and see just what I'm looking at instead of like Could be an ambulance. It's definitely not a cop car. So there's that. <sighs> eyeshadow. I didn't really pick out any eyeshadows. I couldn't really think of anything that I wanted. So I think I'm just gonna do the subculture. So we're going to start with edge. I'm just going to put that on like as a halo right here. Oh no. Let's go into cube for the highlight. Let's get that out of the way because I'm pretty sure that's not going to change. Hmm. Oh, you know what I did? I used two different colors. I used cube and electric. What are you doing? You see your water? No? And then I'm going to go into fudge for my crease color. I kind of want to do rowdy, but I think brown will make it more cohesive rather than like full spectrum every color he's not a liquor he'll give you like one little but he doesn't like i've had a lot of dogs that all they do is lick so it's kind of refreshing to be left alone 
this is actually call it I call this one my crease brush I'm not sure if that's what it's called it's called the contour brush so let's go into fudge right here oh yeah that's pretty good guys I don't trust you what are you doing do you have a new schedule I'm unaware of There you go. That's good. Give it a little bit for forever. <laughs> like my brush fit in there perfect. I'm like I would keep it in there, but no, now it's stuck in here. Okay. So, anyways, I'm not done with my eyes yet. I'm gonna do more foundation work first. So we'll do some creamy concealer. What does she even call it again? Power Plush Long Wear Concealer. What is he eating now? I know what it is. It's um pancake batter. The water that I filled into the container that it was in. Hi. a good base it does have a good reflect too I like this um, if you're gonna be having a spotlight or photos or anything if you use it right in your right color <laughs> because it does so much for brightening if it's the wrong color and the light hits it it's gonna be very obvious but if you just I would think go up a shade that if you think I don't know it probably needs to be one or two shades darker but I usually use it to brighten my under eyes, so that's why I got this one. This is 3.5N. Because I am neutral toned. So it's listed for um, moisture. There's like this serum in it, so it's supposed to be moisturizing. I can see, like it always says this dewy finish. But I also, when I put it on, I feel it and I see it on my dry skin patches. So I would not categorize it as that like they did. But I really do think that it's it's good. Like I'm not gonna un like it. I, I mean I love it. It's very easy, good coverage. The color, I feel like it's growing on me and also it makes a huge difference if you use the base that was made to work with it. Um, it just either no base at all because it might mix with it and change its color or with the base blurring primer that it has um, sold next to it in the store. I got this from Ulta. Ulta. Is that the only place that sells this other than her website? Um, it's just local and I hate waiting for things to ship. So I was like, if I'm going to get it, I want it now. What are you eating? What even is this? I still don't know. It's an apple. Are you eating an apple? A little piece of an apple. Oh, shoot, shoot. Why are you so hungry? Is that why? Are you, oh, you should just. <laughs> okay. Try to finish up this eye makeup look now. So, I'm going to go under my eye with Fudge. Try to have more like a shadow effect than anything, than a defined line. Some people put eyeliner here. I might even blend it out with a brush. Raz, dog bed! Dog bed! I'm right here with you, you're okay. Put that in here. 
I have this like perfectly organized, let's see how long this lasts, box of things that I use every day, at least so far. So, um, and then I got lazy and I threw in every single eyeliner and mascara because this fits. So it's separated, but it's all in there because I'm mostly creative when it comes to picking liners. Um, if I want white, green, I have all these different colors and I just like to have all the options available to me. So what are we going to do? I'm actually going to color my lips in with this because I really wanted a dark effect. This is in reverb, but it just wasn't purple dark enough, so I'm going to try this again. It's a little bit drier than the Kylie lip liner, I'm not going to lie, but I like that I don't have to sharpen it. I'm pretty sure I have it right here. Yeah, so I have to sharpen the Kylie lip liner, but the formula, I like it better. So, and it's probably that, like that's probably why um, it is better because it's creamier and more preserved than this is kind of like a stick inside plastic that you, it's got a space around it, air can get in there. So. I love the Kylie eyeliner, you guys. It stays so well and it goes on so pure black. It's definitely, I've been trying eyeliners and brands for 30 years because <laughs> I'm 35, but like probably 25 years. Yeah, I don't know. Well, I started using my mom's makeup pretty young. I was in dance class and stuff, um, but it's good. It is a good mascara eyeliner. It's a good eyeliner. I want to try her mascara, and it was on super sale. I think it ended last night, and I just didn't commit because it's Christmas, and I think I've been spoiled plenty enough, and I got to get my son some stuff, so like, I just don't feel like buying myself anything right now. Um, actually, probably not for a long time, so it's just not the good. It's not a good time to even think about it. But that's the one thing I do need is mascara. A new one. But she does sell her small sizes too. Like a travel size for $7.50. I think it's originally $13.50, but that was the sale and I almost bit. And I was just so worried about spending my money on it. And it being bad. And I was like, no. Not right now. Ah! <sighs> As you are stinky, I think it's time for you to take a bath. He smells like Cheetos or Cheez Its when he starts to like ferment. I usually give him a bath myself, but sometimes I splurge and I bring him to the groomers. <laughs> Where did I put the cap? Why is my life so hard? It's in here. It's in the bag. Okay. Oh, no, it's not in the bag. This is my teeny, teeny, tiny one. Oh, it's right here. Okay. I want to, you know what I want to do is give this to my mom because this is literally like she has eyeliner until it is, you know, architects on their pencils or some people with their pencils. It's like that with her eyeliner. She does not buy a new one unless she needs a new one so she might like it i don't think she's much of a black eyeliner person she usually uses like a blue gray color so because she's her her tones are so different than mine so different she's so white she's irish she's very very pale with freckles and red hair but um i say blonde because it's like strawberry blonde her natural hair color um it's pretty light so Back in the day when she had hair. Just kidding, Mom, I love you. She's not. <laughs> if she has any issues with thinning hair, it's probably my fault. So, Okay, so we're just going to scoop. Like a little rounded scoop. And we're just putting enough to make a, a fake shadow, okay? Now all of a sudden I'm a pro. <laughs> so, same here. 
And so there's this line that I'm seeing and I'm just trying to like go on top of it. Oh, the other side came out better because I'm using my left hand. Um, so this looks better. Add some more just in case, just because it looks so good. I might want to ruin it. Uh, so back to front is usually a good way, like a foolproof way to do it. There. And then just kind of fill it in some. <laughs> back to front. So good. So it does, I mean... If I got my way, I'm kind of goth sometimes with my makeup application. It would be a little bit more gray, more black, because it looks kind of orangey. Raz likes my brushes. He tries to eat them. Okay, let's get some sun on the forehead area. This is some fake sun. Try not to make blotches. Sometimes it comes out so blotchy. I want it closer to my hairline because it kind of looks like hairline white and then broads. So that's not what would happen. I'll be editing on this computer, so hopefully it'll be good. Yeah, don't even need blush. Can you imagine? No blush. That's never. Ready into this Mary Kay Citrus Bloom blush lately. <sighs> That's okay. It makes them a little bit more defined. I don't want to have like ah coming at you lashes. So. Eyebrows. I meant to say eyebrows. I was actually going to use my Mary Kay lip gloss today, Pink Satin, but just maybe tomorrow or something. Definitely before Christmas. Mary Kay is. I know Mary. I, I read the book, so. <laughs> okay. I think it's cute. It's a little dark. It's a little dark. I like it. It's like that bitchy girl that works at Hot Topic, you know? Kind of. I think I'm just going to do the lip oil and no lipstick. We'll see how that looks. <laughs> you can hardly see it so dark and then ooh, I got a good gob not too much gob good gob godfather Ben and Jerry's I haven't been eating any Ben and Jerry's you know what it's probably my lack of dairy I do have a lot of cheese though which is weird hmm I'm not sure though but <sighs> Setting spray. And then I'm done. The professional. I was thinking about getting brow stuff in a, a full size professional. Maybe for the new year or something. I don't think I've ever even tried their mascaras though. Anastasia Beverly Hills is known for their brows too. So it's like between Benefit Brow and ABH. But Benefit has been surprising me with a lot of their products. So there are obviously things that I choose from other brands, but um, they're really standing out. So I don't like to get all the same things from one brand. I really like Ariana Grande. I like R.E.M. So I was just being like a fangirl moment. Um, but when it comes down to it, I think Benefit's really starting to take over with just what I like about them and the price point too. So it's more geared towards like teens and things like that, but... I don't think that I'm mature enough to worry or use my makeup. Like, if maybe if there was an event 
then I might invest in um, high <laughs> something a little bit more high end or like Lancome or um, what Dior. That's just like I see it. I like it. It's just not like, did you really have to do that? It's just not what I want. What are you doing? You know, water? You're gonna get some water? Where's that? There is everything. So, um, but I call this coal. Get it? C O A L. I think coal. It's just dark. It's a little dark. Dog bed. What are you doing other than getting into trouble? Dog bed. Right now. Stay. You'll be good. So anyways, I will see you guys. Um, thanks for sticking with me and I'll see you on the next one.